Then he goes down the next word. He said, if the, if the princes of this world do, the one who have crucified the Lord of glory, it is in my book that's the, that's the greatest mistake in the strategy of the prosecutor. Have they known the one who have crucified Jesus Christ? That was a trap for themselves. So you see, beloved, every time the enemy tried to set it up, God has set it up for the blessing. Paul said that the greatest mistake the devil ever made to crucify Jesus. Brother, that's the best you can look at the devil in every situation, in your sickness, in your trials, in financial difficulties, and say, devil, the mistake you made was to crucify Jesus. That's my power. Let go to the woman. And he said to the woman, I will increase your trouble. In pregnancy and your being in giving birth, you will say, oh my God. I will increase your trouble in pregnancy and your being in giving birth. Man, I pray for all you women here. That's why men who can ill treat women who not share blood for you. You're not normal. I rather say that you're not normal. The best thing you can do for a woman if you don't want them to treat them with dignity and respect, but don't bow above them. That one of the messages she gave to me that children, that children, you know the folks are having them. She was nothing. That girl children. That girl. Why is it more wholesome? Hey, you know, my young men don't like that, but you're not normal, spread, you're not normal. That girl. And they agree. They're not taking that curse for themselves. All the women here, they knew where you want. You're not getting they, they curse, you're not getting it. So may I come to you. They got their curse to satisfy you and myself. And then you want to play with them. And then may you tell them that you're not normal. I pray that you're not normal. You're not ready to I will emphasize it. I think the first experience I had on when we gave birth to my first child, we go to the hospital and they started treating her from the beginning. Basic hospital, that time I remember, I remember NS Health, they said that too. Redemption said that too. Foods, Mama Point Hospital said that too. They didn't give her the document to that effect. So when the woman in pain, they must send for the ambulance. So the particular day she expressing pain. A week before her time of the upper delivery. So I said, go to the hospital. She goes there, they say, what happened? I stop me, go back. So she comes home, I see her move. And young woman, first time giving birth. And we many because some people who can be crazy and look at, oh, my God, give us some people, okay, then do it and work. So I took I told her brother, I said, I mean the brother, I said, sit down. I said, then the people say she will be one week scope. One week scope that's one thing. So I said that loud. I said you give birth to this. Sit down, wash your feet. I know it didn't make sense to her because you were in pain. But at least she would be in Saddam. I went to Saddam and wash her feet. I don't even know. Later I got I'm there to know. But I thought I did that thing. You can know, say the water bear in boss. Instantly, I confused. So I said, what are you? So I went to one of my pastor friends. He brought his car. That man was like what in the morning. One a.m. because by that time, one between twelve, one twelve, by that time, the hospital, and then they push her in the room. Thirty-five minutes later, she gave birth. She had just been there that evening, and all the men, all the nurses, and then all the uh, and that one will push her inside. My friend was just standing before the people hospital to blast in tongues. <laughs> then some people pregnant with me who been there was dead. And you know, like that, a friend of mine started complaining. Oh, well, yeah, they're not the one yet coming. Then when the brother said that pastor was there, they did it. They took him they said, Nice. So later, one of them came to me and said, Pastor, I'm going to make some baby boy, just like that. But the point is, the thing I saw that day, I said, Men, I said, Men, who can treat women after they do all that thing, but you're not normal. You, you, you got to have to make a place in your feet that you call you blood. Somebody else has not even been able to take pee and that for you. So that the Lord wants to do that, that thing, that four, that five. And stay here and say that oh my God, nothing to offer. Why do you want to offer you? So they are the best men in the world. So people get me their job and their money get to have children. Why you want to get you? They don't bring money. They don't bring nothing. 
but we get the glory. And then even the Bible says, they still come in. When the child's fall, they say that the man's falling. When the child good, good, they say that the child. By the man's fall, yeah, they, by the man, the way they fall, they all can do it. I can tell the Moses from you that you're a man. But when they do good, they say, yeah, that, that, that man's fall, yeah. Men, oh, you men, you will not like me. Yes. 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 
We're going to restore how this morning we are leaders. The Bible was only spoiled. He said, You're not telling me. Go to the what's only happening there. He said, You're not telling me. Because we saw problem. And because we didn't know the principles, that's why even people get your position in the, in the side of position, for a medical position, leadership, and they get to take more than a decision. They don't look at other people. Yes. Everything is about themselves. Money comes, they ready for a health ministry, they eat it, they don't care. And you get can't live. If I eat this money that is meant for hospital and supply in both our country, how many pregnant women are going to die? I can't tell you people money. You say, I'm telling what they for. So, so we come here. This is our piece of peace. Oh, I'll get to one of you today. Tomorrow, the next one will be the men. <laughs> then he said, I will increase your stronger interest. I love the labor foundation. Your trouble. We may understand that. And I'm arming you. The days when you get pregnant, your relationship know that I'm trouble. But you know that trouble, that trouble, that is trouble. I, I come from work. But I'm like, it, don't want to come out. The day pregnancy, she get it now. She get to be late pregnancy. You know what I mean? I'm like, I'm going to be, I'm going to be. And feel on you. I tell the woman like that to the one so the disaster should not watch it. Should not even come for me. Then I go, man. Go, man. You know, we're not going to be to me. It's not a young man. You got to scrub you. <laughs> they say the woman trouble, they increase her trouble. So by the time he got in one more place, he said, I trouble you. Why not this thing? They, and that was it, man. So they have to have to go don't, don't make force to them. You have to bad feeling them. That you trouble you will cope. That you are going to want to cope before I leave. <laughs> because they think I'm going to be a man here today in the morning. Oh, man, don't listen to me. Men, they won't pray that you're here. You're going to pray to them. <laughs> but I can't tell you that you are going to be wrong. That that's not what I'm going to be You think I'm going to be wrong? Hey, the thing is, someone you can put stress on yourself. One of my daughter, I can go talk. She pray that she will but of course, you know, I didn't think I had to get it, you should understand. You already get trouble, be on you. Then you let it in the back You and myself will share that best way. I'll be having the physical pain, but the emotional best way of following you. Everything now, God will leave it in the chapter when you can't have trouble. The thing is, y'all know it. From my own work, some money you work on that you feel good. But then he said, I'm not telling me when I just said, put your whole Gucci. Then he comes up, oh, you're not going to fool yet. That is better than it, that you are going to But I do not want to find a poor head. That is too funny that you're here to help out and you're okay. And I want a friend to come for me and where is that to go? But the poor are not eating it. I will increase your trouble. And your king is giving bread. And then he said, and you will still have desire for your husband. You see that part? That being there. I'll not do it again, but then you deliver for the person. After one year, I'll say to you, see that he's pregnant. You have desire for your husband. But I get there, and I'm ready, I get there. And then he said, you will be subject to him. Hey, listen, 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 listen. Men, and that by the, that by the idea, you see, we don't understand the scripture and things. That by the idea, what was something that the men come from? No, no. This is a curse. What is naturally mean here is that there will always be a tension in the husband and wife, the man and woman relationship. So they say you will desire your husband, yet he will have you will be subject to him. It means that you will be a slave. Before God, God is talking this thing after the last sin. But when they when he made them in the first place, he said he made them build and he knew. He said, be fruitful and multiply. There's nothing about men being subject to woman. Men be subject to woman came as a result of the curse. What God is saying that they're always the attention the husband and wife relationship. What will happen is that the woman wants to do this and says, No, I need to you to all the men. No, it can work. No, it can work. So if you don't understand to go back, what happened when God created them to them to know that we are partners. And we are partners for good and partners for work. We spoil everything together. We got to fix it together. So as I understand and I tell 
to see a man today not down in your pocket. What they commit their life and their future to you is because they see you got vision. You got somewhere you're going. And that's the point of what they say, well, what a beautiful woman do with that man? Oh, no, no, not because of that. They see that that man got something to offer them, and when they help them, they can feel secure. And on the other side, they'll say, but a man got all the money, they got everything, then the woman walking for the home, the woman can be stupid. No, the woman not looking for your money. They don't feel secure about you. You're too arrogant. You're too rude. Everything is good for them. You don't understand. Yeah. I should be here. Somewhere between 
bien. Some right there, I'm going to be there. Then when I get there, I need to find out the reason why I didn't get here. Where I messed up, where I failed, so that I can repeat the same mistake twice. But if you don't have visions and goals, even when you get here, you're not even here. No man, next year you'll be outside the building. <laughs> but you're not here. You got the same thing that made you go behind. Anyone else the people do the same thing. So I am challenging you. You got to ask them. Some of them are going to come back. They're acting as a baby. They're not giving a vision. They don't vision in zero. Right up. But these are the people. No. Hello. Starting bed here. We'll be having a bed to come here and bring all the conferences. Brother, if you know these things, this women can do anything for you. So we understand the principle that you bear back on the wall. The reason why the women are having difficulty is that you make them too smart. You make them too smart. When you follow these principles, they will do anything for you. So next year, that's what you're going to do more women conferences, men conferences, so that people don't understand these biblical conferences. When you understand that life is easy. Life is easy. Hello. Life is easy. Hello. Life is easy. Any man who said the baby, or the one who said the baby, or the one who said the baby, or the one who said the baby, don't ask them for why they're working all the kind of things. Ask them why your business was they are set. And the business said, you want. Don't tell them me. I'm going to take home. Tell them all. Why, so why your business was they are set? And the kind of business you say you want to have. When they keep out their head, you say, go buy a thing and come back. They have to talk. Because if they can't tell you anything about themselves, how they will tell you they have vision for you? This is a reality in life. For the lesson you understand. They go there, they don't want to drop from money already. They say, what is this? When you already have a problem. The best way to have a vision, then you have to drop it. The year kind of put vision in our man here, in our man for you. Hello? They like, you can hear every day that you can put vision. You got to face it. You say, no, it's time for you to stand up and man up. If we can have a healthy family, our society will be healthy. Through our history, all the great nations, the great empires that fell, whenever the family was destroyed, they fell. This nation, that's why I see that something to the family. On Saturdays, on Sundays, on holidays, you see a lot of people getting married. But at the same way, every people get people getting divorced. So people are not understanding the Christians. So people think I need to take an angel. They think I need to take No, there's not an angel. We are already under a curse. That's not redemption king. So, so if you're not possible to go into a relationship or an institution, and you, you don't know the God who said it and the principles, he said, we can make that different time like something together. But he said, if you have a wife relationship, can you give you my love? Daddy, come on. And Daddy, man, anytime you do that, the things will continue. You got to know that I'm too old to get to find So I got to make adjustments. That's why every time people ask me, we have to get out as friends. Are you ready to go to school? I should give my wife and answer that question. Right? But why am I? Because she is the one getting the result of my eyes on. So what? Well, I'm not a good husband, but I'm a good wife. No, who are you man is telling my wife is a good wife? But that's what, you know, the devil wants to destroy the family. So that children will grow in with no man, no man, they grow in the street. They will grow in with one parent. You know, my mom. So they grow, they say, people that want to get up with my mom, they say, I grow in the home, no man. People are growing in the home, no man. They want to get up with one 
and I have been there. But if the child grew up with family, so you are what you are supposed to be about. We know some people, you didn't have their messages, and you died in relationship. But it's not too late for Jesus. If you confession, you get it now, you can change your destiny. You can take a decision that not just for you, but the children you want to have. So that it will not affect you. But all your sin, if you don't destroy them today, they will rise up to fight you for your reason. If you have a relationship problem, when you get caught from one problem to another, and you don't solve it, I'm talking about solving it. And lie down to handle and solve it with money. And you think you can run away, get another way and run away. Blood will still follow your children. Because it's not for you, it's a spiritual sin. So you must succeed escaping it tomorrow to rise up against your children. But we don't want that to be a portion. We want to declare every seed, vocation, or curse, or sin that has been affecting your grandparents, your generation, your great great grandparents that have come down to you, may you be the last to stop. May you kill every seed that will rise up to affect your relationship. I declare my brother bless you from this one. And your redemption. Your relationship, your marriage is all will be peaceful. Yeah, you will be an example to your children. Even the children you have had a grand love of boyfriend and girlfriend. From this information you are have, you will ask God to help you bring the right partners to your life that will help you raise up your children. Men that will love your children. Women that will love your children. Men that will give vision to you and your children and direction. Women that will be mothers to you and your children. But anyone who wants to take advantage of you and declare that they will not see your full number, they will not see your face, I call you for the blood of Jesus. Because family is meant to fulfill God's purpose. But family is used by the enemy to fulfill God's purpose. But we thank God that through Jesus Christ, death, 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 sanction, the enemy was defeated. He helped the Lord. He won the victory. He won in grace. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. 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 Amen.